Hey everybody, welcome to Greybeard's Jewels. Today we bring you 10 fun facts about Georgia. Number 1. The official state fish is the largemouth bass. And since Georgia has some of the best fishing around, they've also given state status to the southern Appalachian brook trout as the state's cold water game fish and the red drum as the state's saltwater fish. When deciding the state freshwater fish, the choice was clear, as the holy grail of competitive freshwater fishing was taken from Georgia waters. In 1932, George Perry skillfully reeled in the legendary 22-pound, 4-ounce largemouth bass, a world record which has only been tied and never beaten. What's the biggest fish you've ever caught? Let us know in the comments below. Number 2. The Vidalia onion is Georgia's state vegetable and is known as the sweetest onion variety in the world. To carry the trademarked Vidalia name, the onions can only be grown in a well-defined 20-county region of southern Georgia. The sandy soil in that area has an unusually low sulfur content, making the variety more sweet than sharp, and the same seed will produce a hotter, stronger onion if grown in other areas. Oniony attractions include the Vidalia Onion Museum and annual Vidalia Onion Festival. Number 3. The annual Masters Golf Tournament takes place at the Augusta Open during the first week of April every year since 1934, with only a few exceptions. Amateur golf legend Bobby Jones both co-founded the Augusta National Golf Club and co-designed the course. The Masters Tournament is one of the four men's major championships in professional golf and the only major played each year at the same course. The most prolific winners include Jack the Golden Bear Nicholas with six wins, Tiger Woods with five, and Arnold Palmer with four. In 2019, the course also began co-hosting the Augusta National Women's Amateur, along with nearby Champions Retreat Golf Club. Before we go any further, we'd like to take a second to thank all of our new and current subscribers. We really appreciate your support. Thank you. Number 4. Callaway Resort and Gardens in Pine Mountain amazes visitors each spring with its world-famous azaleas bearing a vibrant kaleidoscope of colors. The azalea bowl covers 40 acres with over 30,000 azaleas, many planted under the direction of co-founder Virginia Han Callaway with the help of renowned azalea expert Fred Gow. Callaway Gardens also offers two golf courses, the Cecil B. Day Butterfly Center, which is one of the largest tropical butterfly conservatories in North America, and even a Birds of Prey show. If you come during the holiday season, you can enjoy the fantasy and lights displays and beautiful decorations. Number 5. Coca-Cola was invented in Atlanta in May of 1886. The sweet syrup was developed by Dr. John S. Pemberton, who took it to nearby Jacob's Pharmacy to be sold at the soda fountain. Customers could try a sample for just five cents a glass, and the sweet bubbly drink proved quite the hit and would soon be in high demand. The name Coca-Cola was suggested by Pemberton's partner, Frank Robinson, who combined part of the names of two key ingredients, coca leaf extract and the caffeine-containing cola nut. Not long after Coca-Cola's inception, the recipe and rights were sold to Atlanta pharmacist Asa Griggs Candler, who founded the Coca-Cola Company in 1892 and grew it into the worldwide favorite we all know and love today. Number 6. Cumberland Island National Seashore is Georgia's largest barrier island and has three distinct ecosystems, salt marshes, old growth forest, and of course the beach. While many different animals such as alligators and raccoons inhabit the island, there are a few you won't find in most other places. Endangered loggerhead turtles come ashore to nest. Wild horses roam free throughout the island, and nine banned armadillos can be seen scurrying about. While the natural beauty of the island is undeniable, there also are a number of historically significant sites visitors can tour, including the ruins of Dungeness, once a glorious home built by the Carnegie family, which was lost to fire in 1959. 
Number 7. The Georgia Aquarium is one of the largest aquariums in the world. The largest tank holds over 6 million gallons of water and is where you'll find the Ocean Voyager exhibit. Home to all kinds of saltwater animals, from different types of rays and sharks to the odd-looking sawfish, and even whale sharks, the largest fish species in the world. Overall, the aquarium holds 10 million gallons of water and houses more than 100,000 animals and has many exhibits to experience and explore. Pretty amazing! Have you ever been here? What was your favorite part? Let us know in the comments! Number 8. The Marble Quarries of Northern Georgia provide marble of outstanding quality. Since the first quarry and mill were opened during the 1830s, many well-known, historically important, and intricately carved buildings and monuments around the country have been built using the beautiful, durable marble. These include the New York Stock Exchange, the Cleveland Museum of Art, and the statue of Abraham Lincoln that sits watching the land from its spot in the Lincoln Memorial. Number 9. The Okefenokee Swamp in southern Georgia is the largest swamp in North America. The 7,000-year-old peat-filled bog sits inside a huge, saucer-shaped depression that was once part of the ocean floor. It encompasses over 400,000 acres of canals, moss-draped cypress trees, prairies, islands, and lakes, and is home to a multitude of bird and wildlife species, including the largest species of woodpecker, different wading birds, American alligators, and even black bears. Plant life abounds, and you can find anything from water lilies to carnivorous plants. There's so much to see and do here. Check out Okefenokee Swamp Park and Okefenokee Adventures to plan a getaway you'll never forget. Number 10. Peanuts have been the official state crop since 1995. The peanuts grown in Georgia account for about half of the peanuts grown in the United States. Peanuts are the only nuts grown underground and belong to the legume family, which also includes beans and peas. Almost all the peanuts grown here today are the runner type, which are used for peanut butter, snack nuts, and candies. Who's the most famous Georgia peanut farmer, you might ask? Why, it's former President Jimmy Carter. His family raised peanuts in Sumter County for decades. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time on Greybeard's Jewels.